Well, good evening and welcome to the Chevrolet display here at the last day of the New York International Auto Show. If you'd like to learn something about our new small cargo van coming out this fall, the 2015 City Express, then come on over or hang out within earshot. We've got a quick fun presentation for you. Hi, I'm Sabrina Solomon. I'm the owner of Ingenious Interior Design. We take houses and apartments from Brooklyn to the Bronx and turn them into better functioning, more appealing living spaces. Now when we pull up in front of a client's house, I need a vehicle that can store supplies, transport furniture, and look good while doing it. And I'm Scott Drew, head carpenter at Ingenious Interior Design. When Sabrina and I are working on somebody's house, I need a lot of tools, hammers, and drills, you name it. We're from Ingenious Interior Design. And this is how we use our City Express vans. Yep. Now this one's just a sample though, because ours have flames on the outside. <laughs> right. Now, part of why we chose the City Express is because of its great design. It has the kind of appearance we want our clients to associate with us. Sleek, stylish, and ready to meet their needs. Right, instead of bulky, rusted, and ready to fall apart. It's also perfect for the city. It's got a nice tight turning radius, so we can pull all those U-turns since Scott's yeah, always messing up the directions. It's about the size of a car, so it fits in a regular parking spot when you can find one. It even fits in parking garages, which makes it a lot easier for us to work on those new high-rises going up. Also note the sweet custom design made for the side of the van. In fact, Chevrolet's going to be offering custom vinyl wraps for the entire vehicle for businesses directly through the dealerships. It helps to identify us, even when we're on the road. Plus, it makes us feel like we're starring in an episode of our very own design show. <laughs> Attic Impossible. Well, what about Iron Carpenter America? Oh, no, I've got it. Drape Dynasty. But you're going to need to grow out that beard. Oh, thanks. It's a good look. <laughs> Now, with Sabrina's van, we were able to upfit the interiors with a host of different bins and packaging uh, so that her van was ready to work for us as soon as it arrived. And now we've got storage space for everything. Mm -hmm. Not that everything always makes it back where it belongs. This one is messy. Yeah. But instead of having paint cans rolling around on the floor, we have bins to keep them in place, some long shelves for storing rolls of wallpaper, and even some small dividers where Scott keeps his extensive collection of Doritos. Well, sometimes you get hungry on the job. Now, with my van, we left it pretty empty on the inside so that I could use the long 83-inch load floor to accommodate some of our larger renovation mm -hmm. materials and some of the pieces of furniture that we pick up for our clients. In fact, these back doors, as you'll see here, can open all the way up to 180 degrees on either side. Perfect for grabbing, see, the bathroom cabinets that the clients just picked out. For the third time. For the third time. Thankfully, that cabinet vendor is a really patient guy. He is. And thankfully, we got the technology package on our City Express vans. They give us everything we need for a small business, like Bluetooth, so we can stay up to date with our clients' changing plans, even when we're on the road, and navigation to help Scott get around the city, because like I said, this one's not too good with directions. Oh, man, you know, you get lost in Brooklyn one time, and she never lets you forget it. Nope. Now, by the way, I forgot to tell you, the uh, Hendersons called. They decided on the shag carpet instead. Ooh, instead of the Berber? No, it, instead of the wallpaper. Ew. Yeah. Now, if our business model changes, or if we need to add more vans to our fleet as our business grows, we can rely on the largest dealer network in the country to help us upfit them to our needs. We could even take Scott's empty City Express in and give him more storage. I can't wait. My next upgrade, I'm thinking maybe a turbocharger kit. <laughs> nice try. Like I said, Chevy has all the upgrades and interior fittings. We, we really, really need. need right, right. And we don't really need a turbo kit because the engine has enough horsepower and torque to maneuver the city streets and make it onto the highway no problem, even when I've got a full 1,500 pounds of payload in back. In fact, we even see great fuel economy, mid-20s in the city. Also, you're no fun. You'll live. Maybe. Uh, now, we can't always do much about our clients' design decisions. I mean, really? Shag carpet on the walls. It's becoming big in Williamsburg. Oh, ironic. Of course, hipsters would like it. <laughs> but at least we know that with our City Express vans, we're going to be there to help our clients with whatever. Classy, savvy, stylish. Or terrible. Or terrible decisions they may make. Now, if you'd like to design your own City Express vans, then check out the iPads in front here. You can pick out a business name, a color, a logo, and then post that image to uh, your email or Facebook or Twitter. Uh -huh. And if you have any questions, if you need help with that, just ask us. We can also send you more information to your email or your home or business address. 
As for us, I'm Sabrina Solomon. And I'm Scott Drew. We're from Ingenious Interior Design. And that's how we use our City Express vans. Thanks for listening.